I just quickly wanted to, to talk, I uh, guess this video will be t entitled Hotels. It'll be a funny for <laughs> people looking for hotels will forget the video. <laughs> 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 okay. what, what hotel, hotels. Well, what hotel is he trying to sell? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> my, my father does actually have a BNB, so. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, anyway, that's another story. And um, so people with, people with uh, suffering uh, with addictions, you know, like every, nearly, I mean, I go to quite a few different, uh, they're called fellowships for addictions, and hotels are usually a difficult location uh, mm -hmm. because, um, like, you know, we have, there is, there's, there's addictions for food. Often they'll have a little fridge you know, and in that fridge there'll be like peanuts, there'll be yeah. ice cream, there'll be yes. everything, and they, they, they extortionate charges if you dip mm -hmm. into that one. Yes. Then they'll have alcohol, yes. that's yes. another addiction. Mm. Oh, that's interesting, yes. Then they'll have the, t <laughs> then, then they'll have the TV, and then, <laughs> then there can be other things that can happen on the TV that are related yes. to addictions yes. as well. Oh, so, yes. so, so there's very, you know, so it's, if yeah. you're, if you're yeah. if you're in addiction, it can be a minefield, yeah. you know, to, to go to a hotel. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so there's alcohol, uh, <laughs> there's alcohol, yeah. then yeah. There, there's food, yeah. then there's TV. Mm -hmm. You know, so so it's it's uh, it's uh, it's one of those things, and you know, addiction is like you need, you know you you can't be with yourself and feel happy. Yeah. So you need some kind of escape, yeah. and usually if you're alone, away from friends and support mm -hmm. networks. Mm. Alone in a foreign city, uh, stuck yeah. in a hotel, then maybe you want to get comfort from food, mm. maybe you want to get comfort from alcohol, yeah. yes. maybe you want to get yeah. comfort from the TV, yeah. something to like feel a bit better yes. and get a bit of comfort and relief. So, mm. so it's a real, a real uh, bugbear. You know, I, I help people in, in, with, with addictions, and you know, we, I sometimes, you know, this is just a, a, a slightly off topic but you know like the toilets mm -hmm. toilets are also a place where you can also act out in addictions as well you know like eat food bulimics will often yeah. throw up in, yeah. in the toilet or you know eat food or whatever it is or have some alcohol in there and but then I was like when I was speaking to people with addictions like the toilet can be the place you can pray so it can either be a den of addiction or it yes. can be a den of prayer Yes. You know, and I often say to them, pray, pray, yourself. pray, yeah, pray. yeah. A lot of, a lot of, pray, pray. Yeah. Okay. You like, you get down on your knees and you can go like that. And you say, dear God, yes. <laughs> help me. Help me. You know, the like when you feel yeah, the toilet. It's in the toilet. <laughs> the toilet. Come <laughs> right. It's yeah, yeah, true, well, you know. No, it's I true. I that walk sometimes. Yeah, okay. the toilet yeah. is a private like, place. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Like when you feel in like meditation. Yeah, like yeah, you take yourself to a quiet place okay. where you won't be disturbed and then yeah. God please help me I'm feeling this feeling now help me yeah. you know that's right and it does help it, it's okay. really it's it's okay. no it, because it's a quiet place that's yes right. you yes are, you, you're not distracted you're not going to do it like in the conference room you know <laughs> you're not going to do it in the in the in the in the sort of um, yeah. in, in in the restaurant you know you can't really pray in the middle of the restaurant while you're mm -hmm. cutting your salmon you know, and get on your knees and sort of, yeah, no, addicts will get on their knees and they'll mm -hmm. pray. I pray, I pray for a sober day, you know, yeah. and, uh, and it's, it's a quiet place, you know, so, <clears throat> anyway. Why wouldn't you pray in the room? Sorry, I'm not that. How no, I was silly here? Yeah, no, no. Why no, wouldn't you pray in the room? No, you can pray in the room. I, did, no, I, was, I was going off topic a bit. Yeah, so yeah, I, so I, I was going like, like, ch like toilets can be your local church wherever you go. <laughs> Yes, I think. So you're, you're in, you're in, you're in, like in the, in the airport. Yeah, that's no, what, yeah. Well, not really. I mean, like there, it's like a private place yes. because, like, if you're in an airport, you I mean you can't really. Oh. Or if you're in a restaurant, you know, you're not going to get a quiet place. Where where else yeah. but the toilet? Yeah, mm. no, I understand. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, in a, in a hotel room you can. No, pray that's in, what I was thinking. You can pray. I was thinking, in, yeah. Yeah, I was thinking, yeah, I was thinking in the hotel I was, room. I was going off okay, topic. That's fine. Okay, okay yeah. sorry. So the, so the thing to do there, um, so the, the tools you can do, you know, what you need, of course, is spiritual connection, yeah. you know, in the hotel room. So mm -hmm. for anyone who feels like numbing out or distracting in a hotel room, what you need to do, various things, is like before you're, you go to a place where you're going to be 
Well, here are the things I would do anyway. I would like, because nowadays, if you're in a hotel room, you probably have things like uh, Wi-Fi. Mm -hmm. So you might be able to connect with, with, you know, even if you're in like, I don't know, in the middle of Africa, mm. in a hotel room, mm. or in the middle of Japan or something, you know, and you haven't got any friends in the country, you could probably get on WhatsApp or, or yeah, Skype yes. or something, yes. and, uh, you know, have oh. a fr friend in your local Course of Miracles group that you're mm -hmm. buddying up with, mm -hmm. and just Skype them or email them or text them, yes. and that will make you, s you know, as you fill up with that spiritual energy, you won't want to, like, you know, have, have the booze in the yeah. fridge or go or order extra chocolate cake from room service or something yeah. like that so yeah. so you know you fill yourself up spiritually you can pray you can med meditation is might be difficult to do because you might want something easy and fast to get you out yeah. of loneliness but you know meditation yeah. is good listening if you've got YouTube you can listen to some spiritual uh, inspiring stuff yeah. um, <clears throat> doing the you can eat, if you want to apply things, you know, like we talk about cancelling beliefs, you can also, you know, cancel your belief that hotels are difficult locations. You know, I'm an infinite being subject only to what I hold in mind. Mm. Or I cancel my belief that in hotel rooms I'm easy, easy prey to temptation. You know, I'm an infinite being subject only to what I hold in mind. Mm. If it's like, I don't know, if it's the alcohol, I cancel my belief uh, that um, uh, it could be... I cancel my belief that the fridge is a temptation, you know, or that Budweiser is a temptation on an infinite being. Mm. So you want to cancel that, stay connected to fellows, pray, meditate. Um, <clears throat> before you go, maybe take some spiritual literature, a book with you. Um, if you, you know, very nice is if you can make Skype calls to your fellow spiritual friends. Mm -hmm. You know, that will really keep you, mm. make you feel really connected and you mm. won't feel the urge to do something destructive. Mm -hmm. So those are the kinds of things uh, you can do. Uh, I think um, uh, all of those. And once, you're spirit, once you feel spiritually at peace with it inside, you won't want to do anything destructive. Yeah. But if you suddenly feel you're out of your, your normal uh, network of support mm -hmm. and spiritual support and you're in a lonely place in the middle of nowhere in a hotel room, then usually... Um, Unless you're very strongly spiritually connected, you know, the temptation to do something which is not healthy can arise. Mm. So here's the thing, you know, you just, just to get away from those. Mm. <clears throat> mm.